Yo, what's up guys? You're back with your man Tech Nick, your go-to guy for videos on the latest tech. Now today, it's about the latest tech. Once again, I have four top dog Snapdragon 855 chipset mobile devices here with me, all undergoing the ultimate speed test. On my left hand side, I have the Nubia Red Magic 3 with indeed a Snapdragon 855 chipset in it paired with 8 gigs of RAM and 128 gigs of storage. This can go all the way up to 12 gigs of RAM, but I do not have that version. Then to the right of it, we have the Xiaomi Mi 9. This is the version with 8 gigs of RAM and 128 gigs of storage, not the global 6 gigs of RAM variant. Then I have the Lenovo Z6 Pro, which does not have a global launch, and it is indeed 8 gigs of RAM as well with 128 gigs of storage. And then of course on the right hand side, I do indeed have a Snapdragon version S10 Plus with 8 gigs of RAM. This is Snapdragon version since it was released in China and only China and USA have them in that version paired with a Snapdragon chip. Guys, these are all incredible phones and just try and bear with me throughout this test because this is my first ultimate speed test and I'm really excited to see who is going to take the cake with this one. So all of these phones do indeed have some form of bump other than the S10 Plus and the Nubia also has that bit of a ridge so I'm going to go ahead and put the covers on there. And I also just wanted to show you guys before the test that I have gone into developer options of all of the phones and disabled all three animation scales here respectively. I've also gone to the S10 Plus menu and changed the resolution to Full HD Plus since the rest of them are natively at that. Guys, this test is extremely hard to make and I hope that you can bear with me throughout this test of my first ultimate speed test showdown. So I will be using both of my hands and four of my fingers to test this out and I will also be pairing it with my wonderful GoPro Hero 5 just to see that accuracy coming from my fingers that I am indeed touching the apps on all the phones at the exact same time. And without further ado, let's go. So guys, I have put all the rounds at the top off the bat and you can see that they all have zeros at the moment. So as soon as they get allocated a point, those will of course increase. Now I have asked my wife to help me out with round zero, which is the boot up test over here, since I do not necessarily have four hands to boot up all of these phones at the same time. But we did try this and test it out numerous times to get it absolutely perfect. And here it is. So in round zero, we'll be doing the boot. We'll also be doing the speed of how the icons refresh after the boot, as well as the face ID recognition. I will not be doing an under display fingerprint sensor reader test over here since the Nubia does not have that. The Nubia gets the first points over there since it booted up quicker, followed by the Lenovo Z6 Pro and then the Mi 9, and then last place over there was the S10 Plus. Now going in and popping the password in over here, who gets the apps first and the Z6 Pro gets it. So every time that something gets allocated to points, I will indeed put their name at the top of the screen above all the, the devices so it's easier for you guys to follow throughout this clip. Be sure to stick to those scores at the top though so that you can see who is indeed running this ultimate test. Now going with the facial recognition, the first little test of facial recognition there goes to the Red Magic 3. Guys, I have indeed slowed this down tons to see this and the red magic 3 definitely gets it again and let's see what's going to happen with the third time of testing this face id out xiaomi have always been the one to do it or huawei and i'm really impressed that red magic 3 did it again and they're going to get the second point in round zero over here guys so only three points to give away there in round zero and now going on to round one you can see that i've cleared all of the apps there are no recent apps over here guys and we're going to go ahead and start from camera and go all the way down to pubg for round one and then after that we're going to go from pubg all the way back up to camera for round two and then get a total score right at the end okay so we're going to go ahead and start up with camera so let's go and do that three two one Okay, so the Red Magic 3 takes the cake when it comes to opening up the camera, which is really impressive there, guys. Now we're going to flip over the, to the selfie cams and let's see how that plays out. And it is indeed the Xiaomi Mi 9 who gets that point allocated over there. Be sure to stick to those points we are on round one, so the middle points throughout the top over there underneath the branding. And then taking a snap over there, I did slow this down and the Z6 Pro actually did show the animation picture within the picture icon at the bottom left of its screen over there before any of the others took the snap and it has absolutely no animations there whatsoever. Then opening up gallery, we're going to open up there and you can see that the Mi 9 took that as well. So the Mi 9 is now indeed taking the lead in the speed test between these four beasts and now we're going to go ahead and open up the photo so three two one there we go s10 plus took at that time so i guess they are a little bit snappier within their own system app ui interface which is pretty cool to see that the s10 plus actually did get a point early on against these other beasts and opening up calculator over here in three two one we're going to go ahead and open it up and the red magic 3 takes it guys there is actually no dark theme for the red magic 3 its system calculator app is just natively dark i'm not sure why it is that way but it is indeed 
that. So we have the Nubia Red Magic 3 and Mi 9 tying at the moment and the Z6 Pro and S10 Plus also tying over there. Now the Red Magic 3 has taken the lead when we had to go up and go ahead and open up the phone app and now opening up settings in 3, 2, 1. Let's see if the Red Magic 3 can do it once again. And guys, Red Magic 3 again, again. Yeah, so I have put that at the top so it is easier for you guys to read throughout this test. And I also have put all of these phones in the order of their ranking from the Antutu test that I did on them, going from the highest being on the left to the lowest all the way on the right with the S10 Plus. And the lead for the Spotify test over there was indeed the Xiaomi Mi 9. So the Xiaomi is just one point behind the Red Magic 3 over there. And now going ahead and opening up Astral VPN in 3, 2, 1, since we need a VPN in China over here, guys. Uh, we see who's going to take the cake. It's struggling a bit here this time. The Xiaomi Mi 9 gets it again. Another point there, tying it up right at the top there with the Red Magic 3 and the Lenovo Z6 is taking ridiculously long to open up Astro over here. Okay, now we're gonna go ahead and test and turn them all on to see which one can connect the quickest. And we definitely get the S10 Plus over there, which then takes the lead over the Z6 Pro. So it is no longer in last place tied there with the Z6 Pro. The S10 Plus is showing its true colors now. And opening up Facebook over here, let's see who can load it the quickest. And the S10 Plus gets it again. So now the S10 Plus is gonna start using its social media power to jump onto the bandwagon and trade blows with the Red Magic 3 and Xiaomi Mi 9. Let's open up Instagram. S10 Plus again again and I was not wrong obviously I have tested this out already previously to this test and I do kind of know who gets it guys but this is really exciting to see I'm so excited to share this with you guys my first ultimate test and I hope that you guys are enjoying it if you do prefer just a standard 2x2 two two test please let me know in the comments down below as this test was extremely hard to pull off and I did have quite a few little mistakes so if you guys see any cuts in this video I can assure you that I have gone ahead closed the app and then reopened it you saw with the newbie over there that YouTube said that you need play services and it is because I can't get Google Play services on the Nubia though it could still indeed open YouTube but it didn't really matter since it didn't get the point anyway. Now the Mi 9 went ahead and opened up Netflix the quickest and no matter what I did with the Nubia I couldn't get it to that profile screen no matter what so we just have to deal with what it is over there guys and opening up Adobe Photoshop Express going into some more intense apps we have the Red Magic 3 opening it up quicker than anything else in this test over here and opening up a photo over there the z6 pro takes that one so the z6 pro isn't doing terrible it is still far behind the rest of the devices but it's still getting a point now and there which is good to see and it's crazy to see that the s10 plus has now jumped up to mid place with the nubia red magic 3 and exporting a photo the z6 pro did it again i'm actually pretty impressed with that since it doesn't have the fastest ram in this department but nevertheless let's go ahead and open up adobe clip and see what that's all about the xiaomi mi 9 is currently winning and double on the z6 pro over there and the z6 pro is just doing seriously well with adobe apps here guys i'm really happy to see that it is actually doing something it would have sucked if it just stuck there with zero points because i've really been enjoying using this device and exporting a clip samsung take it they are usually faster when it comes to exporting a clip and they do indeed the s10 plus gets the point over there actually knocking out the mi 9 and the red magic 3 taking the lead over there which is seriously unexpected if you guys do enjoy this wallpaper let me know if you guys do and i will pop a link to it down below and opening up google chrome the xiaomi mi 9 does take it no i can't get google apps on the nubia it's for some reason allowed me to get google chrome thank goodness for that since it is indeed in my speed test starting with the first run of games over here we have subway surface which is about to open up here now the nubia is the only gaming phone over here and as expected it jumps and grabs the points over there the nubia red magic 3 only one points behind the s10 plus and the xiaomi mi 9 and two points ahead of the lenovo z6 pro which is really great to see hopefully the nubia can do some sort of magic over here with opening up games and then going ahead and opening up flip diving now the nubia game sensor is not open so it does not have that extra juice coming from its game hub over there since the other phones do not have it. And then going into flip diving, the Z6 Pro takes it. It's actually nearing up there, guys. It's actually kind of reaching. This is actually starting to get really even, this test. And I can't tell you how excited I was to bring this to you guys and share it with you. I'm really enjoying 
talking to you guys about these phones and testing these phones out, it, it's really a huge passion of mine, guys. And then going ahead and opening up the first Angry Birds over here, I did tap them all at the same time. There was a little bit of a touch and put delay over there, though, and the Red Magic 3 takes it when we open up Angry Birds, the first one. So the Red Magic 3, Xiaomi Mi 9, and S10 Plus all on the same point, and the Lenovo Z6 Pro just two points behind. Let's see who is going to take it for round one. It was really interesting since we just have two more apps left. We're going to go ahead and open up Temple Run 2, which actually recently had an update, and I did make sure that all of these apps and games were as most up to date as possible. So going into Temple Run 2, we're going to see as soon as it loads and says play now at the top temple run 2 the red magic 3 does it again guys which then smashes that lead at the top and grabs that extra point to go one ahead of the mi 9 and s10 plus and three ahead of the z6 pro over there now we're going to go into our last game which is definitely the most intense app and game of this entire test which will be pubg mobile and i did get a damn update just before this test just before i opened up the app so i had to let them all update and then i had to close the app and open them all up again so it, there should not be any updates it, though it has to do this checking for update screen every single time if you guys have yet to play pubg this is just what it does and then it goes into the loading screen so you can see that the nubia is actually slightly slower in that regard uh let's see what's going to happen it looks like the xiaomi is going the quickest here at the moment I'm really interested to see who takes it. And the S10 Plus takes it, funny enough, guys. I mean, I don't know if you are as surprised as I am, but in my previous test against the Mi 9, the S10 Plus pretty much lost in almost every aspect, but it did have its animations on, and the Xiaomi did as well. So it seems like the S10s, or Samsung's animations in general, are just slower than the rest because of its wonderful One UI, which I really do definitely like more than a lot of other devices UI. Nevertheless, all the animations are off here, and it looks as if, as if the Nubia Red Magic 3 and the S10 Plus came in tie for round one over there, guys. Now we're going to go ahead and do round two from PUBG all the way back up to camera. The Xiaomi was second in round one over there, and you saw that you saw it first over here. The Mi 9 opened up PUBG first when going back into it, so that RAM management is doing pretty great things on the Xiaomi over there, guys. Now we're going to go ahead and open up Temple Run 2 again, going backwards here, and the Mi 9 and the S10 literally opened up at the exact same time, guys. I checked this, double-checked it, triple-checked it. That is indeed what happened, so they were both allocated a point over there, guys. So overall total score right now, the Nubia Red Magic 3 is in the lead and opening up Angry Birds. The Xiaomi Mi 9 went ahead and opened it up first hand there again making a tie in total points with the red magic 3 since it got no points in round zero over there and then going ahead and opening up flip diving which i'm really excited to see since so many of the devices are similar and the mi 9 and s10 got it like i said i did double and triple check this guys for every each and every app that i opened here i slowed it down as much as possible to see who got the points over there and the z6 pro actually did open the app quicker though it got to the pause screen a little bit more delayed it still does indeed get the app over there with that ex with its first one point in round two and opening up google chrome the xiaomi mi 9 takes it the xiaomi is just going crazy here in round two guys it's doing really well but it'll be interesting to see with its poor ram management later on at the end of the test so opening up adobe Premiere clip over there. We had the Red Magic 3 and the Xiaomi Mi 9 each get a point over there exactly the same time, guys. I can't be more honest with you. And the Red Magic 3 and Mi 9 again opening up Adobe um, Photoshop over here, guys. I'm really impressed since the Lenovo did it earlier and now the Red Magic and the Xiaomi are doing it. And opening up Netflix, surprisingly, Red Magic 3 opened that up quicker going back into it. Now the Red Magic 3 is on the board coming in second in round two and it had no points just two, three apps ago. Now opening up YouTube, we still have that wonderful cannot open without Google Play services on the Nubia, but the Xiaomi Mi 9 took that cake anyway. And opening up Twitter over here, guys, you can see that the Red Magic 3 has taken it again. Now climbing up to that Xiaomi Mi 9 spot over there, even though it is half the points of the Mi 9 halfway through round two over here guys but it's really interesting to see that the Nubia Red Magic 3 is indeed pulling things up quite a bit here and then jumping into Instagram over here guys we're gonna pop right into that in three two one and the Red Magic 3 grabs it again it is doing 
crazy things right now guys i didn't expect it to go so slow in round two and then all of a sudden just snatch up each and every point it really does put a smile on my face i can't tell you enough because i am actually really enjoying the phone even though there is a lack of google services and the s10 plus then went ahead and took over the speed test reopening for facebook and then opening up on astral vpn over here let's see if it can do it again and the red magic 3 and z6 pro exactly the same time opened it up and turning them off the s10 plus took it over there so the s10 plus gets a point over there. Lenovo is pretty much slugging behind them with two points. S10 Plus right after that with four points. The Nubia Red Magic 3 is catching up now with seven points after opening up Spotify, just one point behind the Xiaomi Mi 9, which is really, really interesting to see, guys. And then we're going to go ho go ahead and open up some system apps over here. So starting up with settings, you can see that the Red Magic 3 again got it. Uh, the RAM management in the Xiaomi is actually really poor over here, guys. So they are going ahead and reopening each and every individual app. So now is when the Nubia actually kicks in and, and takes the cake with the S10 Plus. Now when I open up calculator here, guys, my fingers did something that went crazy over here and I accidentally opened phone on the Nubia. So I did not allocate the points over there. So the Z6 Pro and S10 Plus opened it up at exactly the same time for calculator. And then the Xiaomi had to reopen gallery over there again, but the Red Magic 3 definitely took the cake over there. And then our last app, which is camera, opening that up, the Red Magic 3 and the Mi 9 both opened it up at the same time even though the selfie cams were not facing forward that might have a factor to do with it but i couldn't get them all to open the same way again so guys i'm really impressed with the scores that we have here let's go ahead and tally them up so in total points we have 21 points for the nubia in first place we have second place the xiaomi mi 9 with 16 points which is five points behind the nubia then we have the s10 plus in third place just two points behind the mi 9 in third place with 14 points and then in last place we have the lenovo z6 pro in fourth with just nine points guys i can't emphasize enough how amazing all of these phones are and if you pick up any of them you'll be making a great decision since they're all paired with the latest and greatest snapdragon 855 chipset as far as speed goes consistency off the board it's definitely going to be with the nubia red magic 3 and they will be getting a global launch really soon so be excited for that guys if you are indeed interested in this wonderful gaming phone and i will definitely be bringing you guys more tests on all of these devices and i hope that you enjoyed this test as much as i did making it for you guys and until next time this is Technic.